Hey there, plant enthusiasts. We're back at it again. My name is Brad, and welcome back to my channel where we explore the wonderful world of indoor plants. Today, we have an exciting comparison video lined up for you. We'll be taking a closer look at two popular varieties of the ficus elastica, the ruby and the tanniki. These stunning plants have captured the hearts of many with their unique foliage and vibrant colors. Join me as we dive into the similarities and differences between these two beautiful cultivars. Let's go! What? While both the ruby and the tanniki belong to the same species, they do have distinct differences. One notable difference is the coloration and pattern of their leaves. The ruby boasts a dominant deep red hue, while the tanniki showcases a mesmerizing variegation of green, cream, and pink. First up, let's talk about the ficus elastica ruby. As the name suggests, this variety is known for its deep, rich, ruby-colored leaves. The foliage showcases shades of dark green, burgundy, and even hints of purple, creating a striking and visually appealing plant. It's a great choice if you're looking to add a pop of color to your indoor space. If you like videos like this and would like to see more videos about tropical houseplants, be sure to subscribe to the channel. It's totally free and would mean a lot. Thank you so much. I greatly appreciate it. Now, back to the video. I should also note that with the ruby, the more light that it receives, the deeper the red hue that you'll get on your variegation. Now, let's turn our attention to the ficus elastica tanniki. This variety is famous for its variegated leaves, featuring a combination of dark green, cream, and pink tones. The foliage has a marbled appearance, with the colors beautifully blending together. Ficus elastica tanniki adds a touch of elegance and subtlety to any room. In terms of care, both the ficus elastica ruby and the ficus elastica tanniki have similar needs. They prefer bright, indirect light, but can tolerate lower light conditions as well. Avoid placing them in direct sunlight as it can scorch their leaves. When it comes to watering, allow the top inch of the soil to dry out before watering again. These plants prefer slightly moist soil and are susceptible to root rot if overwatered. If you want deeper variegation on both your ficus elastica tanniki and your ficus elastica ruby, the key is to give them as much light as possible. These particular ficus elasticas are grown outside in both spring and summer. This allows for the deep variegation that you see in both the tanniki and the ruby, as well as the massive leaves of the two plants. Maintenance wise, these ficus elastica varieties are relatively easy to care for. Keep an eye out for common pests like spider mites and mealybugs and take necessary measures if infection occurs. Regularly dust the leaves and occasionally wiping them with a damp cloth will keep the foliage clean and healthy. In terms of size and growth, both the ruby and tanniki can reach impressive heights. With proper care and ideal conditions, they can grow up to 10 plus feet tall, making them great statement plants. However, it's important to note that the growth rate may vary depending on environmental factors such as light, temperature, and humidity. To summarize, the ficus elastica ruby and the ficus elastica tanniki are two remarkable varieties within the ficus elastica family. The ruby captivates with its deep ruby colored leaves while the tanniki impresses with its variegated green, cream, and pink foliage. Both plants share similar care requirements, preferring bright indirect light and moderate watering. With their stunning appearance and relatively easy care, they are excellent choices for any plant enthusiast. I hope this comparison helped you gain a better understanding of the unique qualities of the ficus elastica ruby and the ficus elastica tanniki. Remember, it's all about personal preference and finding the plant that resonates with you. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more plant comparisons and care tips. Happy gardening and I'll see you on the next video.